Auckland teen is recovering tonight after stepping on a needle while fishing at a local pond. As Jim Smith shows us, fire crews found even more needles when they investigated the area where that teen got hurt. Sunset at Reed's Pond in Rockland. But there's a big problem. A hidden danger was lurking here this past weekend on this island just offshore. That's where a 16-year-old boy was fishing and accidentally stepped on a huge hypodermic needle. On the island, fire crews found eight more used needles, all of them in an area where someone else could have easily stepped on them. Uh, the uh, fire department and the police came. Yeah, Art goal. Norton let the firemen borrow his canoe to get over to the island. It was like seven or eight of them, I believe. That's what they said, yeah. A little alarming because you like to go out in the island there yourself once in a great Yeah, way. I go out there, I go fishing, you know, I take the kids out there. I mean, this kid was in bare feet, I guess. You know, I go out there in bare feet too, though, so it's like... Wow, you just got to be careful, I guess. The boy was taken to the hospital by his mother to be checked out. Rockland ambulance crews say the risk of being stuck by a needle is an everyday fact of life for them. It's a big problem. You, you worry about finding needles on scene, on people. Um, you worry about the communicable diseases that they have that we might contract. Unfortunately, the issue of used hypodermic needles is not just a problem at this pond and not just a problem for the town of Rockland. Heroin use has exploded. And now a teenage boy has become an innocent victim, collateral damage in a growing drug problem. It's a huge tragedy and, and y y you hate to see that happen to innocent people. In Rockland, Jim Smith, WBZ News.